Miss Wish the deal. It's your girl Monique Will, and we are here for you guys with what's up with the plan is reading regarding the Venus and Virgo transit. Now you know what you guys, whenever I do these types of readings, I make an astrology post about you know the ethors side of the transit. Just what's going on, you know, uh, astrology wise with the transit. So go check that out. Please make sure you guys are liking the video. It truly contributes to the channel. Thank you guys for all the continued support, the bookings, the likes, the shirts, the comments, the subscribes, all that. I truly appreciate it. All right, I am open for personal uh, tarot readings. My pricing information and my contact information is in the description box down below. And all the spiritual businesses that I support will be in the pin comment in the comment section. All right, y'all. So we're going to be pulling one... Y'all came out in the fire sign reading, and it was giving me obsession. As a matter of fact, first sign, y'all was the first card for the fire sign reading. The devil. Capricorn, I don't know. You could be dealing with a fire sign, or a fire sign energy could be around you, or you might be go check that out. Capricorns. So, um, we're going to pull one monthly uh, oracle message card and one weekly message card and see what y'all got going on during this transit. Virgos, this is a... Uh, is gonna have heavy of you influence during this time. So really, uh, you're gonna find yourself, um, Earth signs. I feel like for y'all, you're gonna be easily able to stick to a schedule and a routine. Some of y'all might become a little bit uh, predictable or monotonous. Unpredictable, so try. Okay, so try to roll with me, baby. I'm gonna make you feel like you never felt, girl. I pre okay, see. This came out in the fire sign reading. It's, it's lusty energy. I'm not surprised. Because anytime Venus is in an earth sign energy, it's, um, Venus gets comfortable, right? Because uh, Venus rules, uh, Venus rules the uh, zodiac signs of Taurus and Libra. Um, so, Taurus. It, it's, uh, it's kind of like, um, whenever uh, Venus is grounded, whenever Venus feels comfortable, it can get a little bit, you know, Satisfy me. So I don't know, Earth sign. Some of y'all could be in the space of wanting to be satisfied. Whichever way that goes. Y'all are nasty. What's happening? It's grind time. That's what's happening. It's only a little bit past 11, but I kind of feel like the, the energy that I'm putting out right now might be a reason as to why. But girl, it's just a robe. It's amazing how much a robe could do, okay? Girl, this is the heat and, you know... He leaving the homeboy's crib like, you know, t uh, midnight, one o'clock. He like, yo, you mind if I come over? I'm like, girl, you know, if I'm up, you know, just text me whenever you're on the way. I'm going to be up, but you know. <laughs> Are we speaking from experience? I don't know. Anyway, we're going to pull one monthly message card and one weekly message and see what y'all got going on during this transit. Spirit guys, uh, also, if your Venus is in an earth sign, this is probably going to resonate as well. Spirit guys, uh, uh, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> I don't know. What's going to be happening to all earth signs during this Venus and Virgo transit, July 21st until August 15th in the year 2021, Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn? Okay. Oh no, girl, what happened? <laughs> Divine feminine. All right, but relationship terminated on the bottom of the deck. Uh, Taurus, this could be going heavy for y'all because y'all know Divine feminine can be represented by the Empress card, and Empress is usually Taurus and her Libra energy, right? So, oh, relationship terminated. Some of y'all could decide to leave a certain uh, relationship, or you have, and something about you leaving that is coming up now. I don't know, y'all. We gonna see. Some of y'all are gonna be very, um, very fond of music. I feel like Earth signs. Y'all are gonna be very, uh, very attracted to the uh, senses, the five senses. Uh, what is it? Touch, taste, sound, see, and touch, taste, sound, see, and hear. All right, so some of y'all are going to be uh, really wanting to listen to music that makes you feel good, uh, that makes you kind of vibe. Now, my Venus isn't in an earth sign, so I don't know why this is hitting me like this, okay? <laughs> but yeah, some of y'all are going to be um, wanting to uh, eat eat well. Um, <laughs> be happy, be healthy, be careful about overindulging in food, bulls. All right, but uh, eat well. You're going to want to listen to good music, uh, be more... Um, you want to be entertained. Didn't I say 
at the beginning of the reading, some of y'all are going to want to uh, feel pleasure during this transit. Go ahead and see what y'all got going on. Spirit guys, what's going to be happening to all uh, Earth signs during this Venus and Virgo transit, July 21st until August 15th in the year 2021? Excuse me. to an original so some of y'all need to be careful cheaper isn't always better okay uh make sure y'all spending money on quality shit all right uh some of y'all i don't know be willing to spend money on quality things during this time 555 um cheaper isn't always better i'm hearing so like i said be willing to spend uh extra money on quality teams, Earth sign. I'm gonna put that back in the deck. Spirit guys, what's gonna be going? Uh, what's gonna be happening to all Earth signs during this Venus and Virgo transit, July 21st until August 15th in the year 2021? We're gonna put it down because it flopped out. What's this? What's this? Potential soulmate. Our heart. Okay. <laughs> Potential soulmate with manipulation tactics so divine feminine you out here please be careful about um be, be careful about holding hold, holding on the hope for someone out of potential seeing what they could be but it's like are they actually trying to you know change their ways also men some of y'all need to be careful about uh women like this as well you know what i'm saying them uh looking the part but not acting the part all right What's going on? This is an interesting, uh, an interesting tale here. A tale of two cities, Earth signs. Let's go ahead and see what y'all got going on. Oh no, I done knocked over the soap. All right, coming out to a pop. I don't know, some of y'all could be in a relationship right now during this time with the water sign, specifically a cancer. Love is on your mind. You're actively dating or you're wanting to date. Yeah, some of y'all are feeling a little bit mushy, gushy. World card and the two of cups. Some of y'all could be in a relationship with someone and you could be uh traveling with this person during this transit. Alright. Other some of y'all uh your uh, standards are changing whenever it comes to lovers. Alright, uh you you starting to want somebody. Some of y'all could be realizing that you like people who are older than you, more mature than you. You kind of either don't want somebody your age or younger than you. It's kind of like I would like them to be older than me, alright. Or overall, like I said, some of you guys' preference could be changing uh, whenever it comes to who you date during this time. Some of you guys want someone who is uh, open to traveling, open to trying uh, new things, embracing new cultures. Just someone who has an open mind. They want to experience new things. They want to evolve, right? Some of y'all could be in a relationship with somebody like that. And it's like, I never knew. You know, I never knew this existed. But we did see some bad news too. But if it come out again, it come out. Remember, we saw manipulation tactics. Sir, so guys, uh, what's gonna be happening to all Earth signs during this Venus and Virgo transit, July twenty first until August fifteenth in the year twenty twenty one? Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn. The world card it still came out with the Queen of Wands. So what's going on here? Some of y'all I just heard got some sort of a uh, show to attend. I don't know if you're in the show, you constructed the show. Some of y'all had some sort of event to attend and you gotta, you know, uh, be looking uh, right. Queen of Wands is here, you need to be looking right, all right? Some of y'all could have Saturn and a fire sign. Okay. Some of you guys, there's somebody who you uh, are dating. Mm, Capricorn, come here. <laughs> come here. Capricorn, some of you guys have some people from your past who are uh, looking at you kind of like, y'all got some people doing double takes. Go watch the fire sign read. Because I told you, Capricorn, it's crazy too. I told you, you came out in the fire sign read and they was getting a little bit of obsession. I don't see it for you yet, but I do see people seeing you out here. You see them seeing you. Two of Pentacles. Mystic, she's here in the building. High Priestess in the Two of Pentacles. So, Taurus and Capricorn. 
some of you guys, there are men and women, okay? So men and women, I'm talking to both of y'all. Some of y'all, there are men and women from your past, people who you used to date, people who you uh, walked away from or they walked away from you. They feel like they missed out on an opportunity. Some of these people, uh, no, these people are still physically attracted to you, earth signs. Capricorn and Taurus, I'm seeing this heavy for y'all. Um, you still picking up on these people's energy. High Priestess, some of y'all, these uh, people, you can have a lot of soulmates, okay? These are just people who you vibe with spiritually, and you can vibe with, you know, people spiritually. You can vibe with a lot of people spiritually. That's why you got to be careful about who you be, you know, transferring energies with. High Priestess, some of you guys, once you experience a mystic, it's just nothing like it, all right? So, ooh, yeah. Queen of Wands and the uh, High Priestess, some of y'all has a mysterious aura about you that keeps people interested in you. Go check out the fireside reading because this came out for them as well. Like I said, men and women, it's the same thing for both of y'all. Taurus and Capricorn, I'm saying it's heavy for you guys. People from your past see you as an opportunity now with the world card. They see you grown. They see you mature. They see you just like, who are you? All right, Ace of Pentacles, you a walking opportunity, a walking uh, trophy, I'm hearing. Be careful about that. Some of you guys could have people that still want to hold on to you during this time. Uh, you could be dealing with this person currently. Some of y'all could be dealing with somebody who was like, oh, fuck no. Yeah, you belong to me now. <laughs> that is crazy. Some of y'all are with someone who, like, they not giving you up without a fight. Uh, I wanted to say some of you guys could have somebody from your past coming back around you and you're in a situation right now. Be careful. I don't want you world starting it up with nobody. Earth signs. I almost wanted to say fire signs. So you could be dealing with a fire sign or a fire sign could be coming back to fuck some shit up for you. And you win some good shit right now. That's why they coming back. They know that. They don't want to let you go. I just can't leave you alone. I know I'm living wrong. So they could be living wrong. They could be leaving... Girl, they could be hip hopping, uh, <laughs> hot scotching in and out of a situation. Virgo and Capricorn, Hermit and the uh, Two of Pentacles. Some of y'all need to be careful about being in on and off situations with people. Uh, spirit guys, how is this Venus and Virgo transit going to be affecting all Earth signs towards Virgo and Capricorn July 21st until August 15th in the year 2021? Ooh, what's this? Okay, moon card with the four of cups. So, some of you guys could be spiritually hungry during this time. You're wanting to experience new things, okay? Uh, it's kind of like you, you want to be satisfied. Some of y'all have a, a, what is it called, a thirst for knowledge. You could be bored. The world card and the moon card. You want to travel certain places, experience different things. Some of you guys want to... Um, um, learn about different cultures, like how uh, things work on the other side of town, like how they be on the west side. In another manner, you know. Some of you guys need to be careful about wanting to do something and then talking yourself out of it. All right, like you want to go on some sort of trip and you like, yeah, but girl, nah, you know, like, girl, if you want to go, then go. Don't you do this, all right? Misty, you keep coming out. What? Yeah, uh, some of you guys are super uh, empathic, empathetic during this time. You're very spiritually absorbent. This came out in the fire sign reading. So please be careful about uh, you taking on other people's insecurities as, as your own. Remember, it came out that you are the Ace of Pentacles earth sign. So some of you guys, you have what it takes. There's people's energy, specifically from your past, people that you know who are putting their insecurities on you uh, spiritually. I'm not saying they're doing it on purpose. It's just kind of like they see you doing things and it's like, why can't I be like Mike? Why can't I be like Jordan? Why can't I be like Matthew? All right? Men, I must be talking to y'all because that was a uh, men's thing. All right? Spirit guys, uh, how is Venus and Virgo transit going to affect all Earth signs? Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn, July 21st until August 15th in the year 2021. Mm -mm. Three of Cups with the Knight of Swords. Some of y'all need to be careful about who you're traveling with. All right, friends, uh, friends that you haven't really known for that long. Some of y'all need to be careful about traveling with people who you've never traveled with before. Like, it's kind of like, um, be careful about how much you have to depend on someone else if you're traveling with them. Like, maybe you need to have your own car. Maybe you need to have your own hotel room. 
I don't know if we're going to be big on sharing earth signs. Remember, Hermit card came out, so some of y'all need to be careful. Um, be careful. I want to say be uh be comfortable with you know riding solo, right? Some of y'all need to pump your brakes and drive slow, homie. Some of y'all need to be careful about speeding at nighttime. Uh, coming from the club, coming from somebody's crib. Some of y'all need to be careful about speeding at night. I don't know where you be at. Just be careful about speeding at nighttime, all right? And yeah, some of y'all, them blue lights might come up behind you. Six of swords, real nice and smooth. I don't know. Some of y'all could have got a speeding ticket as of recent. It happened at night. Some of y'all could have been drinking. I don't know, some of y'all could have got a speeding ticket and you might have been drinking and maybe you didn't get caught for that or shit. Somebody here could have got a DUI. As of recent, all right. Make that big of a deal, girl. Just don't do it again. You need to be careful about doing that shit. Well, it is a big of a deal. Let's not do that, all right. Some of y'all need to be careful about that. If you know you're going to be drinking and you can't stay over at a friend house, control yourself or don't drink. When I say control yourself, tell yourself, no, I'm not having no more drinks because I know I need to go be fuck home, all right? <sighs> Some of y'all need to be careful about the clicks out here. Be careful. Don't go chasing waterfalls. Some of y'all need to be careful about chasing waterfalls. Please stick to the rivers and the lakes that you used to. Uh, be careful about seeing others succeed at something and being like, oh, I'm going to do that too. Like, it's like, if you don't have a uh, genuine interest in something, don't think that because you see somebody else succeeding at it that you can do it too. You have to find your own niche and make that shit bust, you know. Some of y'all could have a moon or your uh, either your moon or your Saturn is in water. Spirit guys. How is this Venus and Virgo transit going to affect all Earth signs, Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn, July 21st until August 15th in the year 2021? Men. Yeah, y'all, I told you, I know I didn't have Matthew or Jordan, okay? King of Pentacles with the Three of Swords. Don't like that. Death. Oh, my God. Okay. That, that went a whole other way. Virgo men, some of you guys could be grieving during this time. Uh, you could have lost uh, a friend. Some of y'all have lost a few friends. I feel like you are not dealing with the uh, with, with this well, Virgo men. Moon card. Some of y'all are just internalizing the pain. You're not actually coping with the uh, passing of some of you guys' as friends. All right. Ladies, I'm saying y'all, this could be going with you too. Queen of Pentacles. Some of y'all, there's a, a death that has uh happened for a family member or a friend. Because I got Ten of Cups here with the Ten of Swords. Yeah, some of y'all, there could have been a passing. Lord have mercy. Devil, Tower Cards. Some of you guys have lost people, family, and their friends to some harsh circumstances. Whether it had been some street shit. Um... Some trifling, some trifling shit. Some of y'all, I'm gonna be real. It's been, it's been some shit. You know what I mean. All right, moon card and devil card. Some of y'all have lost some people to uh some, to the streets. I'm saying some of y'all could have lost some people to the streets, y'all, or they just was you know living a certain type of life that led to their unfortunate demise, y'all. Real talk. Some of you guys might not be coping with these uh deaths healthy, in a healthy way. Right. I'm gonna be real. Oh my god. Men and women, I don't know which one. Both of y'all out here. Be careful of feeling like you just waiting on your day. I don't know. Some of y'all, you know, I don't know if you got a certain past or some shit. Some people out here are feeling that way. Double card and tower card. They just waiting on the day somebody come, you know, clock their ass. Like, what is happening? Divine feminine. What the fuck? Okay, Empress. Okay, that's, that's some other shit. All right, but, oh, God. Please be careful about thinking that way. Some of y'all are uh, in a functioning depression during this time. Like I said, I feel like you're good at uh, hiding it. Uh, some of y'all need to be careful about that. Some of you guys might consider uh, showing any sort of... It's not even showing emotion. It's just kind of like... Some of 
some of y'all want to be able to handle the deaths of people that have happened uh, happened around you. You want to be able to handle it, um, but your way of handling it is just like internalizing it. You're not coping with the pain. It's just you don't talk about it. You know, like, girl. All right. Now, some of y'all might have to get some grief counseling or, you know, really work on that. All right. Another way, uh, some of y'all, someone who there's no backseas on, uh, this person could be heavy water sign. Uh, yeah, this person could be a water sign. Or a fire sign. This person could be a water sign or a fire sign. There's somebody here who there's no backseas with. Uh, this person has put you through too much pain. Um, there's no rest for the wicked. Somebody here uh, wants to be able to move away from you or move on from you and they can't. Ace of Wands, they still think about you sexually. Seven of Wands, they don't want to. Knight of Pentacles, they want to get away from your ass. Chariot card, but with the Knight of Pentacles, they feel like they can't get over you. Some of y'all, this is concerning a fire sign or a water sign. Uh, Aries and Sagittarius is out here. Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces has come out. Capricorn, Taurus. I feel like this is going for you. Virgo, you too, because Seven of Pentacles is out here. Okay. Like, y'all, this is some heavy shit, all right? Spirit guys, uh, how is this Venus and Virgo transit going to affect all Earth signs? Towards Virgo and Capricorn, July 21st until August 15th in the year 2021. It's got heavy, all right? Nine of Pentacles with the Nine of Wands. Some of y'all need to be careful about blowing the dust off your whole bag if you know you're not about that life. Some of y'all could be um, tempted to do a one-night time, okay? A one-night uh, energy with somebody, a one-nighter, all right? Pack your whole bag and go see somebody. Men and women, I'm seeing this for y'all. Some of y'all need to think think about that. Nine of Pentacles, Taurus, I'm seeing this for y'all. Some of y'all need to be careful about rushing to uh, get back involved with somebody sexually because the Nine of Wands is here. Six of Pentacles, Virgo, this is you too. Some of y'all need to be careful about just, you know, somebody hit you up and boom, you over there. All right, be careful about that. Virgo and Taurus. Six of Wands and the Eight of Cups with the Knight of Cups. Yes, some of y'all need to be careful about somebody being able to walk away from your ass and come back like that and nothing happened. This person, uh, I don't know if you know it, but th you know this person got another situation going on. Three of Cups. Some of y'all, when this person stop dealing with you, they go deal with somebody else. And then they come back because they off on off terms with the other person. Be careful about that, Virgos and Taurus, bulls and scales. But you're not scales, that's Libra. I be thinking about the symbol for Virgo, how I be holding up the scales, versions. Are you though? Spirit God. Woo. Is this what we doing? Taurus, Capricorn. Oh my God. This came out in the fire. I'm reading the devil. Some of y'all need to be careful about people love, uh, like really out here, like having sex with a lot of people, kid, or swapping fluids with a lot of people, earth signs, and you swapping fluids with them too. Some of y'all need to hold up, hold up, hold up. Before you go sticking your weenie in somebody, man. Because King of Pentacles, you right there beside the Knight of Pentacles in the devil card. Listen, men, King of Pentacles, Knight of Pentacles, and the Devil card. Taurus and Capricorn and Virgo men. Some of y'all need to be careful about dealing with someone sexually during this time. I feel like it's a specific person. It's someone who you on and off with. Like I said, it's either a fire sign or a water sign individual. I feel like it's easy access, but there's a reason why it's easy access. Some of y'all, there's someone here who you could be on and off with dealing with during this time or you was and this person is coming back this person got something this devil card is right below this three of cups with the moon card this person got something or either they just got a lot of bodies okay and i don't think they telling you uh, yeah 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 some of y'all i don't know this person could have a lot of body all right or they got a lot of bodies Capricorn, I'm saying this happy for you. Okay, please be careful. This is for you, you, my number one. Okay, eight of wands. Yeah, some of y'all could be getting a, uh, that late night text or that text in general. Drop the Addy. All right, some of y'all could be getting uh, that text from someone during this uh, transit, and you're going to have to fight yourself like, 
No. <laughs> no. I mean, if you don't mind, you know what I'm saying, being a buffet, it's up to you, shorty. Emperor in the, what is that? Eight of Wands, Divine Masculine. Yeah, this is, um, we're talking to you. So, here, guys, how is this Venus and Virgo transit going to affect all Earth signs towards Virgo and Capricorn July 21st until August 15th in the year 2021? Two of Cops with the Hierophant. Okay, men, so talk to me because I'm seeing two separate energies here. Okay. Men, some of y'all are trying to do the right thing right now. Some of y'all world card, king of pentacles, and two of cups. Some of y'all could be in a marriage right now. Or you're with someone who you see long-term stability with. And you could be feeling the temptation from your friends, from just shit around you. Some of y'all need to be careful. You with somebody who you really like, truly like, I feel have genuine feelings for you really like this person. Like I said, you see longevity with them, but there could be temptation uh, around you. You go into the strip club with your friends. Your friends got the holes all the time, all right? Social media. Be careful about the temptation during this time, y'all. Hermit card. Show, shelter yourself away, me and nah. It's just kind of like, yo, world card, you got to have discipline. Like, I'm not going to go see the strippers with y'all. I'm not going to be around all the bitches with y'all. I'm not going to be, be following all these bitches on social media and be seeing ass and titties, right? Only you can prevent forest fires, right? Some of you guys could be single and you want a long-term relationship. Some of y'all feel like uh, whenever I start dating or whoever I decide to start dating, this person need to be uh, marriage material. Taurus so and Virgo, me and y'all are tired, all right? <laughs> oh, my God. Okay. Uh, Taurus and Capricorn men, okay, I guess all the earth sign men, some of you guys have felt like you've been through your bachelor phase, you want a real relationship, will of fortune, you feel like it's time, king of swords, for you to get serious, and find a, uh, yeah, Hermit card, some of y'all feel like I've gotten enough wisdom from, uh, being out in these streets, I've had my whole phase, well, not really your whole phase, like I said, your bachelor phase, the way you were single, you, you were single, you did your thing. And now you're like, I want something serious. Give me something real. All right. Some of y'all really want to um plant seeds with someone. Uh grow with somebody. You don't you, you tie that on and off shit. You want some real, some real shit. It's coming. <laughs> Will of fortune and divine timing, it'll come to you. All right. I just kind of feel like you gotta be really ready. You know, you might feel like that right now, but will you feel like that a month from now? All right. Spirit guys, how is this Venus and Virgo transit going to affect all Earth signs towards Virgo and Capricorn July 21st until August 15th in the year 2021? Three of Swords with the Queen of Wands. Some of y'all need to be careful about getting back involved with somebody who has shown you that they will keep someone hidden from you. Moon card, nine of pentacles, and the three of swords. Your intuition is going to be telling you to take it slow with someone who has kind of like, I'm, I'm going to say it, betrayed you, betrayed your trust. The three of swords is here with the moon card and the three of cups here with the devil card. Some of y'all, there is a karmic person who I kind of feel like looks like a soulmate. It's a karmic soulmate. This is somebody who had the potential, but they turned rotten, all right? It's kind of like y'all could have been something, and they threw it away, all right? It's a fact. Some of you guys could be with a Libra, all right? Um, a Libra or an Aquarius or a water sign or a fire sign. I just listed everybody. Libra, Aquarius, Cancer, Leo, Aries, Sag. Be careful about somebody getting getting you into another karmic cycle with them during this time. I feel like they're going to try to get you with sex. I guess that's their thing. Earth signs. Okay, somebody here wants to get you uh, sexually attached to them again, I'm hearing. Age of Pentacles and the Will of Fortune. Yeah, somebody wants you to invest in them. Some of y'all, somebody wants you to get them pregnant or they want to get you pregnant so you stay uh, attached to them. Spirit guys. That's hard. Uh, how, uh, how is this Venus and Virgo transit going to affect all Earth signs towards Virgo and Capricorn July 15th until uh, 
July 21st until August 15th in the year 2021. Hangman with the Empress. Yes, yeah, some of you guys, Divine Feminine, need to hold your horses with getting involved with, um, with who? Somebody that you left the hell alone. Empress in the Eight of Cups. Uh, ladies, there's some, uh, water sign or air sign that you haven't been talking to that did some fucked up shit to you. They put you in a third party. They broke your heart. They, you know, gave you bomb dick and then dropped a bomb on your ass. Literally, like, Damn. <laughs> Damn, like that, like that. Some of y'all, this person is going to want to rekindle something with you. Four of Wands, this person might invite you over to their house, want to come over to your house, just uh do some sort of, you know, like dinner with you or some shit like that. Some of y'all, this person is going to ask you out on a date. I'm not saying no, don't go, but probably not, all right? Because I feel like this person is trying to play on your emotions during this time. It's kind of like this, uh, this person wants to see, like, can I still get in? Like, if, be careful of somebody, um, did I say it again at the reading? No, I said it's in the fire sign reading. Be careful of somebody trying to make you a throwaway earth signs. There's someone here who has already showed you that they will put you in a third party with someone. You know how they get down. They get around. That's how they get down. They get around. Uh, you need to be careful of this person returning during this time, trying to get you into another karmic cycle with you, with you, with them. All right, this person uh, wants you, like I said, sexually attached to them again. You could have stopped dealing with this person or decided to walk away from this person. Now they uh, they want to try to trap you. Like I said, this person might try to get you pregnant, or they might, you know, want you to get them pregnant. Earth signs. That was y'all Venus and Virgo transit. All right, Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn. Please like the video. Leave a comment telling me if this resonates with you in any way. Subscribe to the channel. Check the description box for my price information as well as my content information to book a personal tarot reading with me. And all the spiritual businesses that I support will be in the pinned comment in the comment section. All right. I got air to do last. Let me go ahead and head up over there. All right, Earth signs. I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.